Wake Up Day. Today is an F day on your schedule. And F stands for Fasten Your Seatbelt. Today is National Seatbelt Day. If you're an adventurous being and would like to take your adventurous spirit and explore, then you should visit Adventure Club in the gym tomorrow morning. They will be discussing upcoming trips. Everyone is welcome. Reminder that the Boys and Girls Club is hosting their annual flag football tournament on Friday. Sign up during your email. Hope to see you there. Also, Model UN members interested in attending the UB conference should pick up a field trip form in the back of Ms. Seibold's room. New members are welcome. Hey, speaking of important issues, Debate Club is also meeting in Ms. Seibold's room on Friday. The topic is death penalty. Annabelle, did you turn in your blue sheet to the Counseling Center yet? Of, of course I did. The Counseling Center needs two weeks notice before uploading anything. Did you? What? Is that even a real question? Heck yeah, I did, bro. Anyways, congrats to Amelia O'Leary, Grace Janice, Reagan Michael, Aaron Horn, Cindy Girardi, Katie Bryan, and myself for signing last night con to continue their academic and athletic careers. Hey, speaking of the one and only Speed Demon Amelia, let's learn a little bit more about her and the as the cross country seat leaves for states. Hey EA, today we are with Amelia O'Leary, a multiple time state champion. So our first question we have for you is what was it like from winning states to going to nationals with much harder competition? Um, it honestly felt like kind of a big jump. Um, in the early season and at states, I was just used to just going out and running strong, honestly by myself. Um, but then at nationals, as soon as the gun went off, I was surrounded by so many girls, and yeah. it felt like I was in last place. Um, but it was really fun. It was different. Um, but I had a good time, and it was a really good experience. Yeah, you looked really strong out there. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> On the topic of racing, um, how do you keep a healthy mindset like while you're racing? Like what keeps you like in check? Yeah, um, I would just say I just got to keep reminding myself of why I'm doing this, and it's because I'm working for my teammates every single day and the girls on my team. Um, and just keeping you guys in my mind, like that pushes me to go through each mile stronger and stronger. Yeah. yeah. So um, our next question for you is, unfortunately after your amazing season, you did get injured and you missed a season of indoor track, but then you came back outdoor track. And how was that transition from being injured for one season and then going back to running? Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna lie, it was a rough transition. Um, when I was taking time to heal, I set goals for myself for the outdoor season, um, but those goals were very high. Yeah. And I was discouraged because um, I learned that I wasn't gonna be able to hit those. Um, but I mean, when I w was taking my time off, I felt kind of lonely, but going back during outdoor, I was back with you guys. And you guys are just such fun people to be around every single day. So you guys helped me stay positive during that like discouraging time, so. Yeah. And then, like, is there, like, anything, like, from, like, you being injured from that? Like, do you think it, like, makes you, like, a stronger runner? Like, like do you just feel, like, more, like, more experienced? Not, like, experienced. No, yeah, but, like, I get what you're saying. Um, I would say so, yeah. I mean, I think I learned a lot from that experience. Um, and running is not linear. Like, you're going to have ups and downs like that, yeah. and you just have to figure out how to go through it and get through it. So. Yeah, definitely. Are there any, like, fun, like, pre-race, like, rituals you have it like you have to do um nothing special i just have to wear the same lightning bolt earrings mm -hmm. for every race um and i wear the same racing socks um and then i have to eat a bagel with peanut butter for breakfast so what yeah. like motivates you to run faster you guys like a thousand percent you guys and oh gosh, the girls <laughs> Um, no, you guys, like, every <laughs> single day when we're going out for a run or we're doing a hard workout, I see all of you guys putting in the work, too. And I know that when I'm on the starting line, I can look at you guys, and I have trust in you, and I know I can count on you. So you guys keep me motivated, and you guys keep me working as hard as I do, and same with you guys. So. That's all from us. Now back to BDTV. That's all from us, EA. Now back to the Mo for Mo Announcements.